Hi, thank you for watching this video. This is the review of Sangyong Tivoli. In this channel, I will be reviewing different cars being sold here in the Philippines. If you like the video, please consider Whoa. subscribing. Thank we you. almost thought that the exhausts are there. We have backup sensors. That's a nice Sangyong Tivoli. And it's a very cute, fun car with a two-tone paint, just like the FJ Cruiser. And the crown trimming, it's cute. Disc brake at the back with two-tone alloy wheel. There's a chrome line. And on the side mirror, there are blinkers. But it doesn't have welcome lights. Keyless entry. Disc brakes, front and back. Daytime running light, projector light, and the other lights with fog lamp. It's a really, really nice looking car. So people are quite alarmed, like afraid to buy this car because of the how rare you find these cars. But they're opening a brand new showroom and service center in Otis. So that's something that we can look up to or look forward to. So we have window light, same as the Rexton, same as the Musso, all plastic. This are leather. These are leather. Nice. Speaker, cup holders, powered seats. Whoa. Oh, what's that sound? It works. Whoa. Let's get inside. Echo mode, sports mode, and normal mode. So this is how the interior looks like. Whoa. Definitely it doesn't look cheap. Definitely the ergonomics, the dashboard, and everything looks spacious. A lot of blanks here, auto light, rain sensing, windshield wiper, hands free, and the button to control the auto. That's a flat bottom steering wheel, and it's leather. Okay, there's a start push start button. Let me try without the key. Ta-da! <laughs> so in Sangyong, you really have to press the key, the button with the key. Okay, people, let's complain about this one. It's going to get scratches and dirt and all the finger, uh, finger, uh, fingerprint. Mm -hmm. Airbag. I wonder what this does. Please leave in the comments below if you know what this thing does. You can definitely press it. Air condition. It's an analog type. Well, well, looks like a toy. Honestly, it looks like a toy and cheap. <laughs> Place to play something. Glove box. And air convent. 12 volt, 12 volt USB. Heat. Oh, it also has cool seat. Ventilated seats. Hot and cold. <gasps> Automatic. Looks nice. Ashtray. Side brake. Whoa! Console! There's light for sure. There's light for sure. Sunglass, vice, uh, sunglass case, light, light, and door. The headliner is really nice. It's black, so you won't have dirt in there. Let's go to the back. Oh, you have the speaker and the window and the door, uh, door handle and the cup holder. Let's go to the back. It's a fun car. You don't see this here. These are like, it reminds me of those provincial buses. They have this. So you can play something there. Cabin light. Same door panel. It's all leather. Uh, behind here, you don't have the hot seat, the heated seat, cup holders, 
Everything's padded with leather like things. Definitely doesn't feel cheap. And there's a very little hump here. So you can be accommodated. Let's go to the back. Let me show you the car again. Looks nice. There's a backup camera. And I can Okay, it's a button, it's a it's a electric type. So you just press it and it will open. <gasps> The boot space is huge. Well, not huge, but uh, you can place a lot of things here. There's a 12 volt, there's a light, and you can easily fold. Oh, I don't know how to fold it. I don't know how to fold it. Spare tire with all the tools inside. Let me close it. Do you like this car, guys? So guys, if you like this review, please press the like button. Please comment. And subscribe for more. If you enjoyed the video, please press the like button, comment, and consider subscribing. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.